lovely, lovely Wednesday evening. TikTok, lovely to have you with us. And dinky do, I say to you, we're looking at show number 62. There we are, and uh, we're just getting joined by our wonderful internet phone-in people. A very, very good evening to you, everybody, right across the internet. Welcome on TikTok, welcome on YouTube, welcome on Twitch, welcome on LinkedIn, and, of course, welcome on Facebook Live. There we are, tremendous stuff. Mad Dog Johnny has just joined us. A very, very warm welcome and a very, very good evening to you from me, Scotty McClue. Great stuff. Lots of new TikTok videos for you. So get watching and get liking, I say. Tremendous stuff. And a very warm welcome to you on the internet phone-in for this Wednesday evening. How amazing is that? Come on the chat. Let us know that you are there, of course. Subscribe and tap the bell on YouTube. We must get these subscribers moving upwards all the time. How amazing is that? There's the wonderful Dee Gurley. Good evening, Scotty. Good evening, Dee. Lovely to have you with us. And Dinky Do. You're live on Scotty's phone in. Who's that? Hello? Hello, Scotty. It's Martin. How are you, son? Martin, well done. You're very quick off the mark tonight, La. Oh yes, I have got a whole bundle of TV series for you. I am, I am going to read out to you. Right. And you can tell me. I've seen them. And have I got to tell you if I know them or not? Yes. Right. Excellent. Can I find the book? Yes. No, no. Get the book. I think that's important. Oh. You've got. Right. Where's the book, Martin? Hello, Martin, says Dee, Dinky Doo. Hi, Scotty and Dee, says Susan. Hi, Susan. Lovely to have you with us at Dinky Doo. So there we are. Wonderful stuff. Are you know the guy who works in the castle? There we are. I might be, Natasha. Yes, indeed. And Dinky Doo, I say to you. There we are. Quick off the mark, oh, Martin. Very quick off the mark tonight, folks. Are you not on TV? I am indeed, Natasha. You're quite right. Are you there, Martin? Here, Scott, I've got it. Here we go. First, first, um, first minister. First minister, yeah, absolutely superb. Yes, minister, do you mean? Yes. Yes, yes, minister. Yes, that was the one. Um, two, um, two pints of lager. Two pints of lager and a packet of crisps. Yes. What else, Martin? Two point four children. Yes, um, absolutely. After you're gone. After you've gone, did you do last of speechy beachy? Uh, um at home with the breakfast. At home with the breakfast. Yes, Natasha says I do know you, yes, at home with them. Um Balak um Balakus Angel. Oh now Balakus Angel, there's an absolute belter for you. That was fantastic. Uh -huh. Um Mullet of the Glen. Monarch of the Glen on a Sunday night with Richard Bryars and Susan yeah. Hampshire. Uh -huh. Wonderful. Um, birds of a Feather. Birds of a Feather, yes. Absolutely super. Pauline Quirk. Uh-huh. Um, what about Charmed? What was that one called? Charmed. It's a TV series, Charmed. Oh, Charmed. Oh, yes, yes. I remember that one. Yeah, absolutely. Um, called... Cold feet. Cold, cold feet. Yes, yes. Cold, cold feet. Um, next one is CSI New York. CSI New York. Very much so. Is it not still going? Aye. Aye. Doctor Who, Doctor Quinn. Listen to this, JJ Bond here. You're about as Scottish as Mel Gibson. What kind of daft comments that, JJ Bond? I know, I know. <laughs> you know, I mean, what are people like? You can't get more Scottish than Scotty McClure. I am what? Scotland personified. Yes. Yes. What about um, Doctor Who, Doctor Quinn, Father Ted, um, Love, Love, um, Love Joy? Oh, Love Joy on a Sunday night. Fantastic. Ian McShane. Yes. Superb. Um, what about men? And a gentleman in Lovejoy wore a hat just like this. This is nice. Yes. Lovely. What about that? Um, Does anybody remember the gentleman in Lovejoy that wore a hat like this? Yes. What about um, Mrs. Brown Boys? Mrs. Brown's Boys. It's still on. It's great. Uh -huh. Very, um, very funny. 
Right, I think that's plenty for now, Martin. Okay, okay. Lovely talking to you. Okay, I'll um, talk to you later on. Talk to you later on. Lots of love. Dinky do. Yeah, love you, bye. Love you lots. Bye. bye. There we are. That's our Martin. What a guy. Fantastic stuff. Uh, hi, everybody. Dinky do. Hi, Eddie. Lots and lots of things tonight. You're live on Scotty's phone in. Who's that? Hiya, Scotty. It's me, Glenn. Oh, Glenn. How amazing are you? Hi. How you doing? Fantastic, thank you. Kalilio shouting Taggart. The fantastic last call what you had last night, guy. Oh wow, Edward. He was brilliant. He what was, was brilliant. he like? Uh, Amazing. Yeah. Yeah, interesting. He was, he was touching last call that one. Yeah, very interesting man. Absolutely. Yeah. Tinker had the hat, dinky do. Thank you, use Andrew. It was brilliant. You, you took communication for the last call you had, definitely. Oh, right. gee. I'll, I'll upload yeah. it. I'll upload it, I think, Glenn. Yeah, you've got to, yeah. Yep, yep, absolutely. A good guy in many ways. Yeah, and I need to upload one from your good self as well. A really nice guy. If your phone's up, just stay positive, in it. Stay positive, that's what it's all about. And you guys yeah. were beautifully supportive to Edward. Yeah. I love guy, that. Yeah. Fantastic. Yeah. Also, you also yourself as well with him. Oh, Glenn, you're very kind. Everything you were saying to him. Oh, the human beings I did it all. Uh. Kalilio says us TikTokers missed the end of that. Kalilio, the only reason for that we would have gone over the hour, which means I can't upload the TikTok three minutes. So that's yeah. why I should have maybe come back on TikTok. I but I, we're all human beings. We all go through bad times and good times. I, don't we? Glenn, ups and downs. And that's why it's very important we're all there for each other. Yeah. You know, absolutely vital. Yeah, definitely. And, and this is the place to be, isn't it? This is the place to be. But I want to get the subscriptions up on the YouTube channel. And by the end of tonight, there's no reason why it shouldn't think, be 3,000. A lot of people just, they, they just don't... Well, they don't bother, you know, they're, they're getting fed up. They've done it for everyone else. Yeah, it doesn't have anything in it for them. This has got something in it for them. It means they, they get their notifications. They seem to think it's got to be some sort of topic-based thing, don't they? Yeah, and, yeah, and absolutely. Got, all that nonsense. No, no, we can talk got, about anything. I mean, we'll talk tonight. We'll probably mention the budget, but we've started yeah. on television channels. Definitely television right. programs. Exactly. Beachy, um, beachy. I love this. Beachy, beachy says, I watched it on Twitch after 10. Beachy, beachy. I wish you'd also uh, watch Twitch. Does it cost on YouTube? No, Kalilio. That's the whole right. thing. The word is subscribe. And it's a wee bit unfortunate because people think, yeah. oh, is this going to cost me? It right. doesn't the, cost you to subscribe to Scotty McClure. It's free. The word subscribe can be a little bit deceitful can't it? well no a little uh, bit a little bit of dubiety over it yeah that's the thing a lot of people seem to think oh uh, there can be dubiety you know, and it can cause a dichotomy yeah <laughs> you're, having to, you're having to subscribe to things you're having to pay for things it's it's, it's not it, it don't work like that well you don't have to pay a thing for scotty McClure ever unless you actually yeah. wanted to Unless, um, unless credits were in law and phone, Scotty, or something Aye, like that. Aye, that's uh, it. And it's it's now that, you know. Uh, there's uh, Kirby the Annihilator from America, the ineffable and wildly handsome Scotsman himself. How do you do, it, Mr. McClure? Scotty, where do you work your phone calls through? Is it through Skype or...? Uh, through Skype, yeah. Through Skype, yeah. Yeah, absolutely. That's Perhaps you need to make it clearer, because I thought subscribe was a cost. No, I think a yeah. lot of people think that, Cornelio, and subscribe on YouTube, Scotty McClue's channel, absolutely 100% free. Subscribing means that you end up getting the best of it. Yeah, uh, you get the best of it, absolutely. So there we are. Uh, mean, it's uh, YouTube. It sells that use the term subscribe. Uh, sorry, it's you YouTube think? itself that uses the term subscribe. I know. And that's why we want everybody to subscribe. It's free. Guys, go and do it now. Would you say the good lines then through Skype then? Would you say it puts a good signal out? Well, excuse me, Glenn. Are you and I talking to each other? Exactly. <laughs> so I think there's your answer, La. Yeah, definitely. Do you yeah. know what I mean? I remember uh, in South Yorkshire one day, 
I uh, yeah. got this second-hand lawnmower. And it was it had a squeaking wheel which I was pressing on with, and the neighbour appeared with a can of, you know, a certain proprietary squirt, and he squished the wheel and it went absolutely a hundred percent silent, and I said, I've just got this more. Do you think it's any good? And he said, Well, it's got your grass, isn't it? Well, what do you want? You know, and and I thought yeah. this is beautiful. This I is mean, Yorkshire. You ask a question, you get an answer. There, there is times though when you when you've got products or whatever you've got, saying is it any good? Yeah. It does the job, does it? Well, it does the job, and I mean that's I, what it's I, about. As long as you as long as you know what you're doing and you know how to control it. And well, I mean, I remember that. getting a new clutch in my car, and I said to the mechanic, "Do you think it's all right?" He went, "Well, you're getting all the gears." Yeah. <laughs> do, you, do you think the fundamentals are more modern things are, are still around in Scotland? Well, I think that I think people ask questions because we get our confidence knocked all the time, usually yeah. by the people that should be building it up. You, so you, you end up getting that. a little bit unsure of yourself, and of course, Sometimes, governments yeah. love that because they think, "Hey, a bit more control here." Some say that that's where people. Jump in any kind of thing. Yeah. Think. Yeah. Instead of going, no, help these people out. They go, yeah. right, what can we screw them for? Yeah, precisely. We'll take advantage of the situation. How much can we get out them old ladies for yeah. gas? And it, it's all wrong, that, isn't it? Well, of course it's wrong. It's, of course it yeah. is. And I mean, this is why you think, you know, you see, one of the reasons getting out of Europe, we had lovely cheap food and lots of it. Yeah. You know, you go to the supermarket, the shelves were absolutely bulging. You thought, eh, them carrots are a good price, aren't they? Yeah. I mean, a couple of, obviously, we locked down and that, which I won't go into, into too much detail. People were just panicked by where they? Yeah. Yeah, that's what's wrong with them, Glenn, you see. Couldn't get their act together. Toilet rolls were just going off the shelves like yeah, that. Yeah, toilet rolls, I mean, now, you know, you've only got one bottom. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? What? I remember somebody as a joke had put on, we'll swap four bedroom townhouse in London for two toilet rolls. And putting prices up a toilet roll for that. <laughs> 20 quid. It's ridiculous, isn't you it? You know, same with hand sanitizer. Exactly. Didn't they ever use it before this situation? No, this is the whole and thing. Nobody hard, bothered, you know? You know? It's, it's took a big pandemic for it to start. Here, what about this? Billy Ness says, I think Yorkshire folks are very honest and to the point. 100% yeah. Billy. And, and Scott Stenar as well, Scott. The Count Murky Lago. Good evening, Scotty. I hope you had a good day. Jarra John. Dinky do. <laughs> we've, we've got natural resources out there, Scotty, aren't we? Yeah, and we should be using them. And we've got, we'll, we'll find out what the climate's saying. If, if we did like a Bear Grylls kind of thing. Yeah, well, some people feel like Bear grills when they lose the mobile. Yeah, definitely. I've you, you seen them and they're like, oh. Love his stuff. Up. Absolutely love it. Oh, yeah, great to watch. Stuff and all this. And Very clever. Mind you, that we can't that. really all live like that. You know what I mean? Because, a lot of people you know, are, police, would come and, police would come and get us if we started lighting fires and cooking sheep and, you know. Yeah, it's like a zombie kind of world at times with mobiles, isn't it? Yeah, that's it. Well, they're all on them. You watch in the train when people you say, I tell you this, love, you used to sit in the train listening to conversations. Yeah. Oh, right. Well, I, is that Chesterfield? Ah, oh, it's next stop. I'm off. I, I, yeah, they I, used I, to. I, 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 no, I'm going to Drunfield, love. And you had all that going on, right? I'm just, yeah. And, and, and now, not a sound. They're all tap, 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 tap. Unless you signal a big sound. You know. And you I feel mean, like saying to your friends, anybody want to come round to mine on Saturday and go on the phone? Yeah, exactly. It's, th th this, do you think there's too, much, there's too much of it now? Isn't oh, it? far too much of it. Having said that, I think you should be on it when, uh, when yeah, Scotty McClure's that. on. That's the, that's the most, that's the mandatory yeah. bit. I think the whole raison d'etre for mobile phones should be to get the internet phone in. But mobile phones aren't used just as mobiles these days. All these kind of There's things. a rune from uh, saying to me, up the Royal Artillery. 
Do you, do you remember when the big house bricks were out, Scotty? The big old phones. Oh, then when it first started. Yeah. Yes, absolutely. The the first mobiles. Correct. Yeah. Right. Here's one for you, Glenn. We ordered yeah. two for the radio station. Right mm -hmm. now, your problem was it was only your pal that was on the network. It was like a small car battery with a great big broad strap you put over your shoulder. Yeah. And you carried this, and it had like a full proper receiver on it and a dial. Yeah. And you carried this thing around, you know, and you, you could ring your mate and say, hang on a minute. Beep, 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 beep. Hello? Hello? <laughs> yeah. Hello? Can you hear you? Yeah, hello. Oh, oh, beep. oh, it's wrong off. And that, you know, how's that for communication? And now look at it. Yeah, it's just. I love Rooney. It says, stop blaming this on the government. Are you joking? If you can't connect through your mobile, connect through your Wi Fi, are you? Hey, Chris is saying to Rooney, he knows what you are saying is not daft, unlike yourself, he says to him. <laughs> I love the TikTokers because they've got me back, Glenn. You know what I mean? Yeah. You know, anybody starts, they start on them. It's a good bit of banter, isn't it, Sky? Better banter. Yeah. Anyway, better dash talking of banter. Well, you, well, you've got that, though. You've got all that. You've, you've got banter everywhere, haven't you? Oh, there's banter. But it's on here, and we love that. That's that. You've got it all. You've got it all together, Sky. You've got it all. Well, we're, we're getting it together. We're getting it together, lot. Well, thanks to the likes of thee. It's only going to get better, isn't it? It's going okay. to be huge. Trust me. You this just, will absolutely explode. Scotty, you just want the subscription? Finish yeah. To just build up, right? There's just Chris. Hit that subscribe button. Yep. Hit the subscribe button on the YouTube channel. It's free. Love you lots, Glenn. Love you, Sky. Dinky do, la la. See you, la. There we are. That's our yeah. Glenn. What a top man. Absolutely. What are you all saying? Um, D. Gurley. Ha ha. Scotty. Love it. Uh, you can use good quality vodka as a sanitizer. All right. There's Mike saying, thank you, do, sir. Great to hear and see you. Mike, thank you. Lovely to have you with us. And thank you, do. It's 30 years in June since we all met. Isn't that absolutely incredible? That's a top, top, top broadcaster joining us on the stream. What have I joined, says that Scottish couple. You've joined the internet phone in. The world's top broadcaster, hashtag float eye, first lord of the internet. So there we are, based in top cliff in Thirsk. Up the, what are you talking, ruin. What rubbish are you talking? Up the Royal Artillery. Yes, indeed, we've got that. Runa, you never see, you're shouting out, Chucky Allah. That happened 99 years ago. You're a bit late. Uh, that Scottish couple, absolutely wonderful stuff. Dinky do. Uh, so, Runa, don't start bringing in a lot of uh, nonsense politics that people aren't interested in. There we go. Uh, ban him, Scotty. I think I will. If there's any more cheek, we'll just send him. Doing the Swanee on a lifetime ban ticket. There we are. Doing the Swanee. This is every day. Yep, absolutely. That's what's happening. Hello, Martin. Good evening. Good evening, everybody. Hi, Eddie. Last of the summer wine, a classic. A few wore a bonnet like you, says Billy. Absolutely, Billy. Dinky do to the TikTokers. So lovely to have you with us. And thank you for all my likes. Doing the Swanee. Yeah, we will do. Uh, the only politics I'm interested in is Scotland gaining independence and building a fairer nation. Absolutely, that Scottish couple, especially after today's budget. That was a bit of a damp squib, wasn't it? And no mention of Brexit, the costs. Uh, I'm not doing too bad, says Dee. Been a busy week. My mum's in hospital, so a bit of a worry. Dealing with some family things, but plodding along. Hope you're doing okay, Dee Gurley. What a fabulous lady. They love you on here, Dee. You're welcome, Dee, says Susan. We should donate the Waverley steamboat to the Up Helia in Shetland. Do away with it. It's the Titanic week. Now, Professor Numpteed, that's a dreadful thing to say. Uh, Chris says, I'm Catholic Celtic fan. Yes. Uh, that's, they're not mutually exclusive, you know. 
being Catholic and a Celtic fan. Ex-army British soldier married to an English woman. What do you think of that, Chris? That's the stuff. Tell him to get it right round him. Fantastic. Not seen the budget, nothing to talk about. Calelio, there is nothing to talk about, really. You know, it's sort of give and take. It's McGee and McTack. There we go. Scotty. So there we are. Um, no, Rune, no. Well, I'm not him. So I don't care what he said. Nobody else says it on here. There we are. June Joy. No, Nigel, we don't do these. Is Kareem calling tonight, says Glenn. Let's hope so, Glenn, but he hasn't called yet. So there we are. That's it. Good Yorkshire answer for you. Fantastic. Hey, up, Mr. McClue, my darling. Listen to you in the 90s on the radio. Wondered where you went. Glad I found you again on Tinternet. Claire McAndrew, what a privilege to hear you. Yes, where did you used to listen? And we'll piece the jigsaw together. I'm looking for bus drivers, says Keith Snedden. Keith, we'll see how we get on. No discrimination or racism on Scotty McClure. Kareem is a top man indeed. Scotty, let's make a deal. Well, Ruani, you'll have to start talking sense and not living a hundred years ago. <clears throat> You're live on Scotty's phone in. Who's that? Hi, Scotty, it's me again. Oh, Cled, for goodness sake. Scotty, you're going to keep you on your toes, aren't you? Yeah, you're, I'm keeping, you're keeping me on my toes, la. But would you not rather leave a wee space between your calls? No, it's nobody else's phone's up in it. You might as well just keep it fresh, aren't you? Well, keep it fresh, love. Well, I've got Andrew saying, are you the real king of all media, Scotty? Yes, I am, Andrew. I am the first lord of the internet, and that's where the media's at these that. days. That's where it all began. Scotty. Yeah, that and the old digital radio nowadays. Yeah. Yeah. The old digital radio songs, really. We'll, ha Scotty, we'll have to yeah. get Scotty on the digital radio as well. Yeah. We'll get the internet phone in on the digital radio. That'd be good, wouldn't it? You can still call it the internet phone in, because it always yeah. will be, you see. It's beautiful. Could you broadcast this on radio then, Scotty? Yeah, of course you can. All you need to do is hook it all up. Yeah. Off you go. Everybody can get it. Yeah. Get it in the cars nowadays. Yeah, duh. You know, I mean, they should be able to get this. They should be able to get this. Yeah, on radio, on the airbase. Yeah, remember, we've only been running now, we're in our seventh week. Yeah. This is number 62, is that right? You'll be able to see it more than I can, Glenn. 60, well, sorry, 62, number 62, I think. Is it? I think so. Nice. So just over a couple of months then. Yeah, just over a couple of months. There we go. Fantastic. Number 62. Well, remember we did the mornings. We did a week of mornings. Yeah. Oh, hang on a minute. I'm getting a connection notice here. All right. Something's happened to the connection. Please stand by. We're restoring it. So I hope it's all right. Yeah. yeah. 24 billion for housing, says Danny. That's not bad, Danny, is it? To start. Do you think that's decent, Scotty, that 24? Uh, 24 billion. Well, Brexit, yeah. it's a tenth of the cost of mm -hmm. Brexit. So there could have been there could have been 11 times that for housing. There's still a lot of homeless people out there, though, Scotty, isn't there? Yeah, but I think you'll find you'll always get homeless people in that they're homeless for a whole yeah. variety of reasons. I mean, yeah. some of them are very fragile mentally. Some of them are on uh, substance abuse, drink, drugs, all that yeah, stuff. Definitely. Some of them have just fallen in hard times. Some of them are wounded soldiers that they're not looking after properly. It's just a matter of bad circumstances, Scotty, really, isn't it? Professor Numpty, he says, connections back, Scotty. I think sometimes you've just got to think... Bless your lucky stars, really, aren't you, at times? Well, of course you have. I mean, you know, I mean, uh, you know, I, I always give to people because, you know, they're one paycheck away from, from me, you know? Yeah, things get took for granted, don't they? Well, of course they do. I mean, this is it, yeah. you know. I mean, it's a tough time. I mean, you look at, you know, we're, we're, we're trying to get the GoFundMe together. We're nearly yeah. halfway there. I think we're a five or short. It's not bad, is it? So it's coming on stronger, isn't it, definitely? Yeah, so 50%. We've raised 50%. Yeah. You know? But it, it, it's like I said, it's just 
Just come from strength to strength, really, and it's... Ruani says, how do I ring in, Scotty? Ruani, you look in front of you at my TikTok bio. Below that is the YouTube link. Click on that, subscribe, tap the bell. doesn't cost you anything, and you'll well, get you... the phone number. We're well, live on YouTube. Well you, do, well, you do some alterations to your fonts and that, then, Scotty. Like, yeah, I mean, we'll start to, you know, I mean, if, if we can get some little bits of money in, we'll start building. Yeah. Jazz it up a little bit. And well, that. from from little acorns, great oaks grow. Exactly. What's your thoughts it... on the Queen not attending COP twenty six, Scotty? Well, it will reduce a little bit the caliber of COP twenty six, not having somebody yeah. like the Queen there. But having said that, she, uh, you know, is uh, working very, very hard, and uh, I'm sure they'll uh, they'll stagger by. So she needs to put her feet up a bit, Scotty, and just take it. I think she bit. deserves to put her feet up. I mean, she'll always remain yeah. queen, uh, you yeah. know, but she works terribly, terribly hard. A lot of people don't appreciate that, do they? No, they don't understand it, Glenn, the halfwits. Yeah. You know, there's a lot of halfwits out there. They didn't stick in at school, and they've never done very much since, you know. And they think she just... Sits there just doing yeah, they, they think she sits in a castle, as they call it. I mean, would you would you like to stay in a castle? Woo! little bit chilly for me. You, you, you'd you love it for the night, Scotty, wouldn't you? Well, for the night, you know, when you say, hey, can you get them big paraffin eaters in, please, these big diesel eaters, and, and blow up the heat for the Great Hall? Oh, that'd be I'd say, and shut them, put them tapestries up, and shut them doors. That's where draft's coming in. No, no point worrying about the windows. They, they might as well be open. A, a nice um, a nice evening in the castle. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Shut that big front door. Hurry up. Come in quick. You'd be the lord of the manor, Scott. <laughs> Get them big diesel heaters in for Great Hall. Get them big... I have a big firework display. In the I the big ground. diesel heaters. Have you ever seen them? When, when, when I, I used to go to church uh, every Sunday, and in the winter, the heating broke down once in a church. Now, I don't know if you've ever sat in an unheated church, but it is not for the faint-hearted. You know, I mean, I mean, Eskimos would feel the chill. You know, Santa, Santa would be shivering. So, so, anyway, this lad owned a garage, and he had these big diesel heaters. Yeah. They were fired up with diesel air heaters and he got in and fired the place up early. Ooh, it was lovely and warm. I, I, I don't like it when it gets a bit close, a bit toasty, Scotty, at times. You know, like a bit chilly. Oh, I, oh, no, we like to see the seasons, Glenn, but you don't want to yeah, sit definitely. in your house with no heat. And I worry about the old folk while these companies are, are, are you know, screwing every day. Mm. You know, and saying, oh, it's the cost, wholesale cost of gas. I mean, my yep. company wrote to me today and said, don't worry too much because we buy, our, our prices are way ahead. Yeah. You know, they're well organized. What about this? So, Does Glenn want a man? Says Keith. I love his accent. <laughs> Does Glenn want a man? Says Keith. I love his accent. Brilliant. <laughs> <laughs> Do you reckon... Um, D. Gurley says, ha ah, so true, Scotty. It's cold in they, castles. They should be looking out more of them for elderly when it gets to winter time. these companies. They right, should be they? looking for them, seeing they're all right. I mean, I know yeah. some companies do have a conscience and they put you on a register of vulnerable people. So they're yeah. not going to screw them for the for the bill right away if they can't pay, you know. They're few and far between, though, aren't they? Oh, very few and far between. Here's uh, Alice uh, in the north of England. A new radio station for Scotty McClue. I hope that is in the budget. Isn't that lovely? There we are. Well, we're, save we're saving up, Alice. And from Little Acorns, Great Oaks Grow. Well, it's doing well on the internet. Just keep it as it is, Scotty, isn't it? Yeah, absolutely. Well, the well, UC cut is not good for family, says Susan. Yeah. So she's talking about budget. So there we are. There's Billy Ness the advertising a lovely, a lovely gas company. There's Billy Ness the advertising a lovely, a lovely gas company. They buy their gas way ahead of time. It's not lovely. Not Glenn, good. I'm going to have to dash la. Scotty, it's not going to please the public. The budget's off at time, is it? With prices, no. Prices increase. Never. No. 
And what are you doing? You're shoving up the beer, aren't you? Yeah, definitely, yeah. You know, I mean, I can remember beer at two and tuppens a pint. Yeah. Two shillings and tuppens. It's about three and a half quid a pint now, Sky. Half pint for a shilling. Three fifty a pint. Ah, too much. 